Back in two days, we'll find out if San Francisco's polarizing District Attorney Cheza Bodine will be ousted. He faces a recall election largely prompted by accusations that he is soft on crime. He declined to do an interview with KPIX 5's Betty Yu, so she talked to people on both sides of Proposition H. Supporters of the recall of District Attorney Chase Boudin rallied on the corner of Ocean and Geneva this past week, urging people to vote yes on H. Among the volunteers, former prosecutor Brooke Jenkins. She says she's one of some 50 attorneys to leave the DA's office since he took over in 2020. Chesa doesn't prioritize public safety in his decision making at all. And we one thing that I will say is that the prior administration took violent crime and chronic offenders very, very seriously. We dealt with them uh, the way that they needed to be dealt with. Chesa takes a lenient approach with every single offender. The DA's office is in complete turmoil at this Jenkins, who identifies as progressive, spent more than seven years prosecuting cases. She believes Boudin has made San Francisco more dangerous. As we saw with uh, his drug, drug dealing cases, he's charged over a thousand cases, but 64% were resolved for misdemeanors, low level misdemeanors uh, with no no jail time, no requirement for vocational training. The ACLU of Northern California opposes the recall. Chesa Boudin has implemented really sensible public safety policies. For example, reducing incarceration when it's safe to do so. For also, he's taken steps to not charge children as adults. He set up a task force to examine wrongful convictions. The San Francisco Democratic Party also supports Boudin, who ran on a platform of criminal justice reform. Well, criminal justice reform is actually a number of things. But the things that come to mind for me are the policies that hold accountable, accountable powerful people, for instance, bad cops, who abuse black and brown people. San Francisco Chinatown native Roger Moy says Boudin hasn't done enough for crime victims. Nobody's representing the victims. I've never done this. I'm a conservative person, but I'm not going to sit on my like everyone else. He also says he's witnessed the degradation of the city under Boudin's watch. Enough is enough. You go down Chinatown, go downtown. When, you, when I was a kid, I roamed the neighborhood. It was clean. You look through the city, go anywhere. It's filth, crap, graffiti, closed business everywhere. It was never like this. In San Francisco, Betty Yu, KPIX 5.